Geoengineering Arizona. Thank you for watching. This video is designed to show you what geoengineering looks like and what it looks like as it fans out against the Arizona backdrop sky. As you can see, coal fly ash, a number of chemicals, barium, strontium, nanotech aluminum, as they fan out, it creates a white ash. So it was designed to mimic the volcanoes. They put coal carbon into the air, which blocked the sun. So they're trying to block the sun with stratospheric aerosol injection, using a number of components to deliver it, which are not good for the human body. They've already shown up in water samples, air samples. As you see, as they fan out, the next plane delivers the next geoengineering trail, and it too starts to fan out. This is not water vapor. There, there it is. They're using exceptionally small planes. Just a little so guy. So small you can hardly see them. They're like Lear jets. Specialized <laughs> geoengineering planes, simply put. Oh, yeah. There is no question. They're nine out of ten times not available. You can see the material continually spread, depending on the wind pattern. But it always blows into the sun, which hence solar radiation. Just walked management. outside. Let's see if we can catch them. I'm going to look them up. Does that look like a contrail to you? Well, it looks like it's a United flight operated by Republic Air, something like that. Are you kidding me? We do not effing consent. Alright, it's either an Airbus or Southwest. Uh, they're on today. I had two different planes this could have been. I think it's a Disney livery plane. Or there was a non-available, but it didn't seem to be going the same angle. Let's see here. It says they're only at 33,000 feet. We should be able to see them pretty good. Damn, that's long, guys. That's right back to the old days when they used to just hammer this stuff down. Is anybody concerned? Not only the spraying of our heads, but our kids' heads at our kids' schools. It's landing in the water, the schoolyard. Is anybody else concerned? 
of the implications of aluminum in the human body, Alzheimer's, dementia. I could go on. People with neurological symptoms, when this stuff is sprayed, they have flare-ups. I know two of them. Its effects are much larger than us. We need air samples. We need to know what's in there. We need a material data sheet. Where are you, little buddy? Today. I'm not really sure, guys. There he is. He's in here. Mm-hmm. Nice job, buddy. Welcome to the Matrix, the Mesa Messi Matrix. We do not consent. Thank you for watching. I have a time lapse going. They're still going at it. We do not consent. Have a great day.